Hi, it's Jennifer from Soul Source Tarot, and I'm here to do the daily vibes for around the 6th. Keep in mind that the timing is fluid. We're just going to see what comes up. This reading may or may not be for you. And the timing is fluid. I didn't say that already. What do we have for a message? What's coming? Please show me what's coming. Knight of Pentacles reversed. So the Knight of Pentacles reversed is somebody that is inflexible. They may be unemployed. They may be becoming unemployed. This is somebody that is irresponsible. They may have food issues. This could be somebody that takes risks, that is a gambler. They are, they don't set goals, they don't follow through. They don't have any uh, long-term goals or long-term plans. Somebody that is unstable too, very unstable. Justice reversed. So there is an injustice here. Somebody doesn't want to be held accountable for their actions. This could see be somebody that is unrealistic, could be a sponger, um, doesn't want to be held accountable. This is unfair treatment and unbalanced. So somebody may be unbalanced. There's a lack of integrity. Somebody's not telling the truth, and that would definitely make sense. This is unstable, insecure, not practical, unrealistic, uh, could be dealing with a liar with justice reversed. Everything not turning out, something not turning out the way they'd hoped. There could be some legal flaws here, you know, there could have been some loopholes. Ace of Cups reversed. Now this is uh, lack of intuition. Could be sadness with the Ace of Cups reversed. It could be there could be some tears that are shed. There's an emotional blockage. This is shutting down. This is a loss of emotional content. There's some sort of imbalance here. Reverse. Now there's an absence of success. There's an absence of victory. These are all reversed. I use this deck a lot. So when they're reversed, there's an absence of something. So the world reversed is a lack of success. This is unfinished business. There's no positive change that is coming because there's too much resistance. Somebody is refusing to listen to anyone, therefore they're not having success. They don't have any long-term plan. Okay, somebody isn't being realistic. Now this could be an unhealthy slob even with the, the, the Knight of Pentacles reversed. This is frustrated. Somebody's very, very frustrated. And both of these cards mirroring each other are lacking goals. So we have somebody here that is lacking goals. They may be dealing with some legal issues or there's some sort of legal flaws. There's a lack of emotional content. There's some sort of uh, lack of success because somebody doesn't follow through. They're not practical. Um, hmm, lack of integrity as well. Doesn't want to be held accountable. King of Swords. So the King of Swords is somebody who is very decisive. Could be somebody in authority that makes a decision. So there is a decision here, but this is a lack of decision. There's been a delay. Okay, this is a delay of, of uh, truth coming out, perhaps. There's been some sort of delay, but somebody has some sort of truth or they have some sort of information. Okay, now this person makes a decision. This person is in a position of authority.
could be a judge. Could this could be a judge? This is could be somebody in law enforcement. Could be somebody in military. This could also be legal. There's some legal matters here. I feel like there's some lies as well. Somebody's not telling the truth. Um, but anyway, somebody knows the truth or is going to see the truth because of this King of Swords. The King of Swords is very discerning. And he is in, or he or she is in a position of authority, a high position of authority. Looks like somebody's not happy. It looks like this person isn't happy. It's like they, they, not happy at all. This person isn't happy at all. It's like this is a difficult decision, but it needs to be made. It needs to be made. There's an injustice. Justice reverses injustice. This is uh, not happy with the outcome. Somebody's not going to be happy with the outcome. There's some legal flaws here. Judgment reversed. Oh my God. Oh, this is legal. There's something to do with legal. There's somebody made a poor judgment call. Somebody made a poor judgment call. And you know, they, 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 they made a really bad choice. And, you know, there's, there's uh, ill health. This is, again, not listening. Not listening to anyone. Making poor choices. So we have somebody here that is making poor choices. There's bad karma here as well. Justice and judgment reverse. Both karma. And they're both reverse. This is bad karma. It is. There's a person in a position of thor authority that is making a decision. It is... You know, karma works in mysterious ways. This this goes back to uh, karma, okay? Let's get the rest of the cards. Nine of Wands reversed. So, uh, somebody's angry. They're very, very, very angry. They're angry. They um, have some hard feelings. They're experiencing some challenges right now. Um, there's a lot of great personal fear. There's a need to be gentle. Somebody is overwhelmed. They're very, very worried. They're, they are. They're in, a, they're in a place of worry. Oh, there we go. Two of Pentacles. Five of Cups. And Six of Cups reversed. Now, Six of Cups reversed is freedom from obligation, packing up, leaving home. Um, selective memory. Nothing stays the same. There could be some child abuse, child neglect. Uh, clinging to the past. There's going to be a decision definitely that is made. We have somebody here that has been going back and forth. They've been going back and forth in regards to what the truth. I feel like there's some sort of sadness for sure with the Five of Cups mirroring the Ace of Cups reverse. There's sadness, there's grieving, there's mourning. We have somebody here that is focused on loss when there's another opportunity. There's an opportunity for happiness but they're not taking it they're focusing on pain from the past pain from the past and because they keep focusing on that pain it's, it's like they're blocking themselves themselves from success somebody is blocking themselves from success and, and having a new life but so so this is going back and forth really really uh about to, somebody's about to take a step because a step is needs to be taken somebody needs to take a step they're about to take a step there's there's been some sort of lies here there is some sort of lies somebody made a really poor judgment call and i think this poor judgment call leads to sadness okay it, it does it leads it leads to leads to sadness it does the poor judgment call leads to sadness um There is going to be a change, though, because it feels like we have somebody here that is is not really paying attention, trying to do so much. Definitely missing opportunities. We have somebody here that is missing opportunities. Um, this person is playing games, and I think this person's about to fall. It feels like they're going to fall. They're going to trip. Some, that's what it feels like to me, like they're going to trip. Um, they're going to trip up. Somebody may f be found guilty as well with the judgment reverse. Or they're hiding their guilt as well. Um, justice and judgment is both bad karma. 
both really bad karma in reversed. Um, there's unfinished business, unfinished business with the past that has caused a lot of hurt. We're having somebody here that can't move on. They can't move on from the pain in the past. They can't. They're still holding on to the pain and they're angry. They're very, very angry. They're angry with life. They're angry with the world. You know, they have their guard up. They're on the defensive. They want to fight all the time. So that's who we're dealing with. And they're emotionally unbalanced. So somebody is emotionally unbalanced. Okay? And they're being, being unrealistic. But the King of Swords is challenging information. This is somebody that is detached. That uses their head. This is somebody that is... It could be somebody in protection services that is watching this person don't look happy. Could be the same person that is upset. Some this person somebody is really upset. It looks like they may have a weapon. I mean, I, and I know I'm changing the story a little bit, but that is a weapon. So somebody is definitely very 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 upset. And they're going back and forth as to, you know, this is what they're going to do. And I feel feel like they, they they may think that life is unfair. This is life, you know. They've been treated unfairly, maybe in the past, maybe from their ex, okay, from somebody, and somebody has been treated unfairly. Ooh. All right. What is going to happen? Seven of Swords. Oh my God. So this happens to be nighttime. So this is nighttime. So uh, what is going to happen? We have this person looks like he's angry. Somebody looks like they're angry to me. This person is very cold and they are very detached and they, and they uh, don't want to be held accountable for their actions by the looks of things. Now the Seven of Swords is about deception. This is somebody, this is deception. This is sneaky very sneaky behavior so we have somebody here that is is being very 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 sneaky they're very cunning they're very coy this person is very quiet they are they're up to no good put it that way there's something that they left though that they need to get there's something that they left that they that they, they that they want to get take a look at that there's one sword down there um so it looks to me I I should zoom in any minute you see the sword down there? So it looks to me like that guy, that person is looking back, looking at, you know, I forgot something. I got to go get it. I got to go. I, I can't leave without it. You know, thinking of, I got to get it. I got to get it. So hmm, this is like getting something that they left. I got to have, I can't just leave that behind. It's like, it's almost like it's, I want to say it's it. I don't know. I hate to say it, but it's almost like, you know. I don't know what it is. Maybe it's evidence. I don't know if it's evidence, but I can't leave it behind. I got to get that. But if they get it, they might get burned. It's a little too close to the fire. They might get caught. So they might get caught. So this person, this is thinking. This is definitely thinking. Should I? It is thinking. It is definitely thinking. So somebody may be thinking about going to get something, but they're worried about getting caught. So somebody is definitely thinking about it. They're going back and forth about it. Um, they may have been neglected as a child or they have some memories of the past that are really causing them a lot of pain. They are with this Five of Swords. So somebody is really feeling a lot of pain and uh, they're not happy. They're definitely not happy at all. And, they're, and this is a poor judgment call. Or call. Um, you know, this is ill health. Very poor health. Somebody is, is in, in very poor health. Hmm. Nine of Swords. Oh my goodness. Oh my God. Oh my God. Oh my God. You know, that kind of thing. We have somebody here that is extremely stressed out. Extremely uh, crying. I do feel like there's tears. I feel, feel like they're crying. I feel like they're suffering. They're suffering alone. They're feeling very alone. Um... They're really uh, struggling. We have somebody here that is really struggling. 
And it's mentally. Seven of Swords, Nine of Swords, they're struggling. And it feels like they don't want to ask for help or they don't want to get help. Three of Swords reversed. Now the Three of Swords is moving on from the past. This is uh, letting go of past hurts. Forgiveness, asking for forgiveness, or extremely heartbroken. We could have somebody here that is extremely heartbroken. Yeah, somebody's heartbroken. And there could be some, there even could be some heart issues here with the Three of Swords, upright or reversed. Because I see poor health with the judgment. There's poor health here. There is. There's stress. And it's, there's a lot of stress. There's a lot of stress. And stress affects your heart. It affects all your organs. Anyhow, there is, there is heart here. So I'm not sure if we have some heart issues here. Somebody could be leaving without saying goodbye with the world card reversed. Okay, this is no closure. There could be some something to do with the heart. Somebody, this is regrets. I think we have somebody here that does have some regrets as well. I think I think they have regrets for doing something, making a poor decision. Somebody probably does have regrets for doing what it because this is a poor decision. So somebody has regrets, but I think they're in too deep. Four of Swords reverse. Extremely ill. Somebody is extremely ill. They may need to go into a retreat and they need to go into retreat fast. Okay, this is this is sick. Uh, very sick. Very, very, very sick. Um, Four of Swords reverse. This is like, this could be the death of a person or the death of an idea. Uh, we have somebody here that has been resisting change. Okay, they... they um, they're suffering. They're really, really, they're exhausted. They have health issues. They're very, very frustrated. It feels like they, um, are having a hard time stepping into their new life. They're, they're resisting change. Definitely with the world card, somebody is resisting change and maybe they're re resisting getting help or dealing with their health issues, and if they don't deal with their health health issues, you know, there could be some problems. Um, this is great sadness. It is great sadness. With the Five of Cups reversed, with the Ace of Cups, re or the Five of Cups upright and the Ace of Cups reversed. And I think there's heartache here. And I, and I know it's reversed, but I'm telling you what my intuition says. I feel like this is, is heartache. It's great sadness. Somebody has made a poor judgment call. They have made a poor judgment call. <laughs> and there's, there's, there's going to be consequences with the judgment and justice, whether they're upright or reversed. There's consequences. There is absolutely some consequences here. So somebody is going to be dealing with some karmic consequences in the next day or two in, in regards to a poor judgment call that they made. I feel as though uh, there's going to be some sort of separation with that Five of Cups or there has been a separation or there's going to be a separation. Uh, there's going to be a separation of some sort. And you may, somebody may say, this isn't fair. This isn't fair. I can't believe this has happened. I can't believe it because this is disbelief. It is, it is. I think it's dis. I think there's disbelief here that this has happened. I do believe there's going to be some consequences. Uh, this is sad. It is, it is, it is. It's sad. I feel like it's heartbreaking. And this is releasing pain. It is. It is releasing pain. The full reverse. This is reckless behavior. Uh, 
and I felt like falling down over here as well, tripping. It could be somebody could trip and fall and, you know, get hurt uh, to an extreme because I do feel like it's an extreme. It could, uh, you know, um, be really, really, really bad, put it that way. Uh, I feel like there's, there's somebody that uh, is reckless. They may be clumsy. They are unprepared. They are unprepared. They're foolish. Okay, I think there's been some sort of misunderstanding and somebody is headed for a fall. They are headed for a fall. And there's been a lack of judgment here. With the fool reverse and the judgment card reverse, somebody is is lacking judgment. They're lacking judgment. And I feel like they're going to be paying some sort of some sort of consequences. You know, there's gonna be consequences for their poor judgment call because I feel like we have some whoever they whatever is happening is says there's foolishness i mean the full reverse is foolishness this is foolish somebody made a foolish call they made a foolish move and they are about to uh deal with some consequences of their foolishness There's fail here. There's a fail. Some, there's a fail. Six of Wands reversed. There's a fail. Mm. This is this is so ill that they may not get up. Lack of closure. No goodbye. Lack of success. Somebody made a foolish, very foolish move. This is, it feels like, st this is like stepping off a cliff, stepping off the edge. This is going over the edge. Somebody may go over the edge. They may do it on purpose. One more card. Poor judgment. Chariot reversed. This is emotional outburst ahead. Disaster ahead. There could be an accident. It is. I mean, I can't make it up. There could be an accident. It's a disaster ahead. Emotional outburst ahead. Uh, somebody can't master their emotions. They are out of control. So I feel like that, you know, things are, something may, may come to a dead stop and they, they just come to a dead end. Okay. It's a dead end. Lack of discipline, lack of willpower, emotional outburst ahead. So there is an emotional outburst ahead. We have an individual here that cannot master their emotions and they may lose control. They may do something on purpose. And it may be a cry for help. May have something to do with a vehicle, you know, the chariot is a vehicle, could be a car, but this, you know, it's just one horse, maybe it's a motorcycle, I don't know. But this is totally out of control. And it's pain induced. It's induced by pain. With the Three of Swords reversed and the Five of Cups. It's, it's pain induced. I feel like somebody's pain from the past is going to push them over the edge. So yeah, that's what I got. Oh, so if this is your story, be prepared for somebody you know or whoever to have an emotional outburst and uh, you know, maybe the authorities get called because of that case, maybe, you know, whatever. Um, 
This person is very unstable. The first card out, the Knight of Pentacles reversed. They are unstable. They are unrealistic. They are not practical. Whoever this person is, is making a foolish judgment call. They lack judgment. And they may come in, uh, you know, crazy. If you think about the chair reversed, whatever is happening, I said, you know, this is be prepared. Okay. For the nine of wands, you may need to protect yourself. We talked about this yesterday. Um... Lack of control, lack of control, out of control, anger, we have anger here, okay, with the chariot reversed and the king of swords, there's anger, we have somebody here that's angry, and they are feeling very alone, they are, they're feeling very, very alone, and I think they are going to uh, show their anger. Good luck.